And we know New Haven is not alone. Hamden High School has also been receiving a few threats. Our team coverage continues there. And Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Roger Suzannon is live at Hamden High School with more on the security changes that will be taking place there. Good morning, Roger. Yeah, good morning, Aya, and students will definitely notice some of these security changes when the high school reopens tomorrow. It's still shut down right now because of multiple online threats. But the first thing that students may notice is just a big increase in security personnel. Four additional people have been hired with the sole purpose of making the school safer. A school resource officer, as well as three additional security guards, and really, that is just one of several big changes that are coming down the pike here at Hamden High School. Now, it has certainly been a very tumultuous time here for the local high school. It's been shut down for the last three school days because of these multiple online threats. There was also, remember, a stabbing just a few steps from campus involving two students last week. And another student was arrested for bringing a loaded gun to school two months ago. So last night, the Board of Ed and local leaders met and came up with several important security enhancements. Along with the additional staff members, the district also purchased four large metal detectors that students will walk through once they arrive in about three weeks. But in the meantime, school staff members will actually use metal detector wands that they're borrowing from the police department. Hammond superintendent says she is also working on a plan to improve the school's mental health support resources. And parents we spoke with are still unnerved by the recent threats of violence, but are cautiously optimistic that these new changes can make a difference. I'm hoping that the steps that the, the board is taking and the town is taking uh, can help us get us in the right direction. Another big change that is coming down the way here in Hampton High School is they've also purchased technology that will allow, alert school leaders whenever a school door is opened here at the high school. Reporting live in Hampton, I'm Roger Suzanne in Channel 3 Eyewitness News.